Hi Scorpios, welcome back to our Enigma Sobi channel. This is Enigma. I'm going to be doing a general reading. Let's see the messages to you, Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Mercury, Sun, Scorpio, plus Ross Watchers. Let's see the messages to you. For personal readings, white spells, premium charge crystals, reach out to me on WhatsApp, Instagram, or email. Someone is thinking about you, okay? Has been wondering what's up to you, what's, what's going on in your life, okay? They're missing you. I feel there's someone that is definitely missing you right now. And there's a feeling of guilt, unfinished business. They didn't get the closure. They still want your love coming in. <clears throat> they think they missed out on a great opportunity of love with you. And they're seeking you again. They've been pushing away all the other options to be with you. Okay? There's someone that is heartbroken, feeling sad, depressed, not happy without you. Okay? Um... <clears throat> They miss the separation. I mean, they miss the communication. They're not liking the separation. They're missing you. Sagittarius energy, Gemini energy, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus signs, Libra energy. This is also one more. Leo, Capricorn, Scorpio. Okay, so Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus energies. These people are missing you. These people are missing the old times. And is feeling hurt for no communication happening. They've been thinking long and non-stop about you. This person is wondering what is going on with the Scorpio. What are they doing right now? I miss them so much. All right. They're planning on reaching out to you. Right. So I'm seeing they're uh, thinking of or planning of reaching out to you with some form of communication they want to win your heart there's someone that wants to secretly is chasing you in their head and now they will be taking action they see you right now as someone that is very successful focused self-centered self-obsessed moving towards new beginnings they see you as someone that has closed the chapter already they see you as someone that has forgotten them okay this could be a scorpio so I feel like this person sees you as someone that does not want any kind of communication with them. Okay? That's how they see this. They want to change things. They're wondering how do they change things. Six of Wands. They want to win you. Wow. This person stays up late thinking about what's going on in your life. They think about you non-stop. Non-stop okay scorpio like this person could be your soulmate i'm seeing uh, okay finances and career past life relationship <clears throat> okay so what I'm seeing right now, this is definitely someone you had a relationship or some sort of communication, some sort of energy, some sort of bond in the past. You were with this person in the past, okay? You guys had a good bonding with each other in the past. They miss you, but I'm seeing you moving on. I'm seeing you focusing on your finances, focusing on your money, your career, after this, you're moving on towards your soulmate. You have someone new coming into your life. Until then, you will see this person begging for your attention. Okay, let's talk about your soulmate. So the, the one that is coming into your life is very dreamy, out of this world, very good looking, hot and happening. And this person is going to open up your heart. They will steal away your heart in no time. And this person is charming as heck. Like, you will be looking at them and you can't take your eyes off of this person. They are very, very charming. Whoever this is. Forgiveness. Oh my gosh. Don't tell me. This reading is going back and forth with the past person. I feel like the past person is right about to come into your life asking for forgiveness. They want to sorry. They want to say sorry. They want to apologize. They miss the connection. They feel like you're their soulmate. They have been watching you doing your thing. They have been watching you making your money becoming more successful staying powerful in your own they're not able to take that you're not talking to them you will see them asking for forgiveness okay their heart is opening up to you finally at one point of time this person was completely closed off didn't care about a thing but now their emotions are opening up towards you scorpio pisces or cancer all right <clears throat> Okay, so 
so what else do i see over here unfinished no way i feel this person is longing for you this is someone from the past that wants to have you and have a new beginning with you their heart is opening up you've opened this person's heart to love they think you're their soulmate you may not be interested in them, but they think you're their person. The reason why they are not opening up to this person, uh, to you, is because of the community. You guys come from different communities. They won't accept, or your community won't accept them. There could be an age difference, or this person lives nearby in your neighborhood. But I'm definitely seeing this person wants to continue the communication. Like they want to build a stronger bond with you. Okay, they're not done with this yet. <clears throat> someone is longing for you definitely seeing this person cannot like this time you will see them explaining themselves you will see them demonstrating their feelings properly word to word they're going to tell you exactly what they feel i feel like this person is becoming obsessed with you in such a way that they can't survive without you they can't survive without communication with you. All right. <clears throat> All right, the books and the protected. I feel like this person feels like you are very busy in your life purpose and you are avoiding this person. You are surrounding yourself, you know, uh, in you're, you're putting yourself in this guarded situation where you just don't want to deal with this person at all. You're protecting yourself, your energy from this person. They understand that you've read them like a book and you know that this person's intentions and now you don't trust them at all. So that is why you're deliberately keeping yourself away from them. They're not liking this. Obviously, they deserve this, whatever you're doing to them. They feel like you're trying to avoid them in all ways or forms. Progress, not perfection. <clears throat> Don't compare yourself to others or judge yourself. Instead, focus upon how far you've come and all that you've learned. So what I'm seeing over here right now is that Scorpio, you've started to take things slowly, easy. You don't want to, you know, prove anyone anything. You just simply are moving towards a positive direction. Okay. And uh, not wanting to be perfect, you know, not trying your, you know, not trying too hard to get things done you just want to take it easy all you're thinking about is moving ahead in life that's it that is what you're focusing most of your energy in scorpio so you're progressing you're moving forward and not thinking about perfection like 10 on 10 everything should be 100 out of 100 right now so it's time for you to stop thinking about uh reaching your goal 100 percent just focus on a current time where you are right now healing moving forward you're very close to your goal very close to finding your soulmate, ending up getting married, having the dream life that you always wanted. You are very close to your goal, but currently you're healing. Okay? You're in this healing period right now. I'm definitely seeing love is definitely coming into your life. Is this true love? But I'm strongly sensing that there's this past person that misses you like hell. They want, they've been fantasizing you guys coming together, getting married. This might not be a reading for everybody, 
but yes there is some truth for everybody in the street that the past definitely certainly misses you some of you will receive an offer and there is another shot but for most of you it's like you forgive them and move on but this person has been fantasized they see you as their soulmate they have been thinking about you guys coming together spending time together living together having fun together <clears throat> five of pentacles and the page of pentacles wheel of fortune Six of Pentacles, King of Swords, the Sun. I feel this person is planning on coming with a solid love offer towards you. They want a new beginning, massive new beginning and a new start with you. Since the no communication, they have been struggling or finding ways to communicate with you. But they're fearful of looking like a stupid person or you might laugh at them. They feel embarrassed, but they're certainly not giving up on you. This person is finding a way in which they don't have to uh, feel embarrassed. They can hide their, you know, uh, vulnerability. All right. And at the same time, they can have a beautiful moment with you for a new beginning. This person is planning on a new beginning in an indirect way. They want to reach out to you in an indirect way. Could be a Leo, could be a Sagittarius. It could be an Aquarius. It could be a Scorpio, um, Virgo, okay? But they are definitely wanting a new beginning, this time in a completely different style. They want something really, really serious, okay? How do you feel about this person? You think this person just wants you for your body? You think this person is self-centered, self-obsessed and they are always controlling things and this person will never go against their family and uh, this is someone that uh, for them money is more important than relationships. You think that this person uh, thinks that uh, money can buy love and they're flirtatious and this person is a player that's how you see this person so you're waiting for a communication that you think can change this person or somewhere that can help them understand that whatever they're doing is not right this could be an aries yeah the tower okay so uh, the page of wands and the tower here You don't want to deal with them. You're like, you're trying to avoid this person as much as you can. You're pushing them away. And you've made up your mind, no matter what happens, you're not going back to this person. You're not giving them any energy. You're not going to marry this person. You, you have nothing to do with this person. And you might even shout at this person. This is what you're thinking. You also feel like they're filled with ego. And they are going to destroy themselves in this energy where they're just thinking about nothing but themselves. So what is the most probable outcome between the two of you? Most probable outcome. Yeah. I'm seeing you moving on to someone else. And uh, I'm seeing them coming after you like crazy. Trying to woo you, seduce you. And interfere in between you and your new love. Okay. And they will get obsessed with you. I'm seeing this person will become um, an addict of yours they will like do everything i'm also seeing this person ending up drinking too much alcohol i don't know if this person drinks or not but i'm seeing they might develop bad habits to calm themselves down because you choosing someone else over them is going to make them crazy as heck i'm also seeing that you can even turn this person into a player possible they could be a capricorn i'm seeing you choosing someone else i'm seeing you uh giving them their karma it's going to hit back at them.
temperance, four of wands. Fool, the lovers. I'm definitely seeing you're being patient. You have someone new coming in two months, two weeks or two days in your life that's going to set you free. You will be soon in a relationship within four months time. I'm seeing you're about to attract your soulmate. And that person could be a Gemini or a Sagittarius, Aquarius possible. But I'm seeing you will be very happy with this new person coming into your life. All right. So I'm seeing you will be um, uh, in a new relationship altogether. I'm seeing a new beginning coming into your life for sure. Okay. So you have a blessed, beautiful relationship right around the corner. And yes, as I was telling you, the past person will be hell envious. They will be very, very envious. And this person secretly has been craving you. Okay. And the fact that you're keeping your life uh, secret from this person is making them even more crazier. I'm seeing you getting fame in the near future. Someone is going to be a CEO. And this person is being nosy right now. Some of you all need to take good care of your health. You may not be taking good care of your health. Either you're taking a lot of coffee, okay? It also means this person is lusting over you. The past person is going crazy. They're trying to manifest you. I'm seeing this person doing spells and stuff to get you to want them. I, they could have C O C I in their name. I'm also seeing some of you recently had an infection. So you're taking good care of yourself right now to be careful spiritually you're feeling more happier and aligned unlike before you're very relaxed these days you're not taking things to your heart anymore i'm seeing the mask i feel this person is wearing a mask of i do not care but they do care okay the past person they're secretly watching you for sure and they're getting the karma Soon they will be getting the karma. It's the season of Saturn. It's the season of karma. Since 2024 adds up to 8. Which means whoever has done you wrong will be getting their karma. Okay. But you are becoming more career oriented. Focused. Goal oriented. And E. CEO. Yeah. I'm seeing growth. I'm seeing a lot of growth. Some of you are into fitness. Okay. Some of you are into gymming. But I'm seeing you are building your health very well. You're taking good care of your health. And being more spiritual is keeping you feeling more relaxed and happier. Okay? So I feel like they secretly want you. They secretly watch you. The past person. They could be in public eye as well. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And then I'm seeing R. This person has these letters. C, I, E, R, C, O. Rocky, someone's name, Ray, Rex, Celine, Cecilia, any name, guys. Ireland, someone's from Canada, someone's from Italy, Russia, Romania. Okay, I'm also seeing you're becoming more... Um, like you're being more uh, oriented towards prayers. You're praying a lot, okay? You're connecting with God more these days. Some of you believe in Jesus. Some of you believe in your own God. Like whoever you believe in, I'm seeing you're becoming more and more religious these days. Okay, enjoy feeling of being connected to God. Prayers and all, you're doing it. Manifest. This will, this will help you manifest big things. I'm seeing the ex will interfere a lot in you and your relationship that you're attracting, your new love, a lot. They will be like interrupting a lot between you guys. So there is an energy of third party interfering all the time, which is your ex. So that it's not done. It's an unfinished business, guys. They're coming. So the only thing that can protect you is your prayers to God. I'm seeing marriage happening. I'm seeing a ring ceremony real soon. I'm seeing you getting married. I'm seeing you being in a relationship. Uh, a, a relationship that never breaks. Okay. That 
uh, goes lifetime. Yeah, I'm seeing marriage happening. So that's about it. I hope you enjoyed this wonderful read. Thank you for your time, Scorpio. Do like, share, comment, and subscribe to I Enigma Scorpio channel. And do like uh, uh, the, what do I say? Yeah, extended link below. Do check out that, okay? I'll see you again. Bye.